want to see if uh, Tony Walker from HBO. If uh, Tony, if you're here, if you want to come up and say a few words on behalf of uh, HBO and uh, the success of this series and, and what it's meant to the, uh, to the HBO brand. Thanks a lot, Tom. Thanks for everybody for coming out today. You know, the, uh, the Superfly series is one of our best successes from a programming story on HBO Sports. We love it, the ratings are great, the fans have embraced it, and why wouldn't you want to see a, a continuous group of fighters tear into each other for fame and glory? I want to thank Tom for continuing his pursuit and putting the show on, because I know it's not easy getting fighters from so many nations to come together to come here in the U.S. to fight. I want to thank Madison Square Garden and the Forum for continuing their, their support of the show, and you got to thank the fighters, as Tom said. These guys, uh, they want to fight. They want to put on a great show. And uh, that always makes a great night for HBO. So September 8th, 9.45 p.m. If you uh, can't be at the forum, please uh, catch it on HBO. Thank you. Thanks, Tony. And we really appreciate HBO's support. Without their support, it's really the best platform to uh, create a star. Uh, Chocotito had so many great fights, tremendous victories until he got onto the HBO platform. That's really when he was recognized for the tremendous fighter uh, that he is and really became a household name, not only here in America, but internationally. Uh, we've priced this event very reasonably. Tickets starting at $25. They're available at Ticketmaster or the Forum Box Office. Um, and it, it's just a, a very fan-friendly event for, the, uh, for all the fans, the media to come down uh, to take a look. We've had uh, Superfly 1, Superfly 2, and now with this, uh, we have the debut of uh, Kazuto Ayoka. Uh, he's a very famous, very legendary fighter in, in Japan. This will be his uh, debut, not only in, on HBO, but in, uh, in the United States. So we expect some great things, uh, a lot of great fights out of Ayoka, um, his opponent, who had a tremendous victory on Superfly 2. Uh, Mick Williams Arroyo, he's actually flying in from Puerto Rico. He was supposed to be here. His flight was three hours delayed, so he will be here tonight. So for all the media that are going to stay for the show, you can uh, do your interviews with, uh, with uh, Mick Williams Arroyo. He had a tremendous victory over, over Colas Cuadras uh, in the last show. So this is, uh, this is one of the spectacular fights uh, of the night, uh, Ioka versus uh, Arroyo. And with that, I'd like to introduce uh, Taku who's the manager for, uh, for Ioka, and he can say a few words, and also, then uh, naturally, we'll, we'll hear from uh, Kazuto himself. Just to clarify, it's Ioka. It sounds Ioka, but it's Ioka. First, I'd like to thank Mr. Tomoropa and HBO for giving me the chance to fight at Superfly 3 and to fight in America. At Superfly 3, I plan to take a big step towards my goal of becoming a position champion. And I plan to show the American boxing fans a great fight that will be exciting. I want to thank Mike Williams Arroyo for taking the fight. I have respect for your boxing, but I look forward to winning this fight. To all my family, friends, sponsors, management, and most of all, my friends back home in Japan, thank you for your support. Thank you again to 360 and HBO. I wanna look forward to being everyone on September 8th at Inglewood or on HBO. Thank you so much. Thank you, Kazuo. We, uh, as I mentioned, we expect great things from him. If, if this is the first fight of the night, the first fight of the triple header, you know what type of night it's gonna be. Uh, we've heard so many great things uh, about all of his accomplishments, all of his victories in Japan, and now having his first fight here in the United States. He's going to train here in the United States, so he will be available to do additional media before uh, the fight. And we're just honored to have Kazuto on the show, and I think you'll see some uh, 
tremendous accomplishments uh, from him. And uh, as I mentioned, McWilliams is on his way. He'll be here, and anyone that wants to do a one-on-one -on -one interview with him, uh, he'll be available later on uh, today. Uh, and also, I want to mention that this will be uh, the first time uh, Kazuto's uh, fighting uh, at 115 pounds at the Super Flyweight Division. So he's moving up uh, for this fight. And uh, it's, it's, this division is so deep uh, and so talented that uh, it's, it's going to be a, a great night on, on September 8th. Uh, next, I'd like to get uh, move forward to uh, a world title fight. It's uh, for the vacant WBO championship. It's going to see Aston Belicte versus Donnie Nietis. Uh, Donnie, you'll remember, uh, had a, uh, also a great win. Uh, defending his uh, uh, flyweight title actually on Superfly 3. So that's a great thing about these series is uh, you, you can mix and match the opponents and, and uh, the champions are willing to fight, uh, tough guys willing to fight other champions and that's that's really what we're what we're excited about. So with that, I want to introduce uh, Guy Taylor, uh, who's the representative for uh, uh, Aston Palikte of uh, Guy. Uh, oh, okay. Or, uh, you know, if you want to say a few words, Guy, on behalf of uh, the promotional uh, company, and then uh, we can have, uh, I think you can, uh, yeah, probably uh, squeeze through uh, over there. It's, uh, Aston is promoted by Ro Jones uh, Promotional uh, Company, and uh, we're, again, we're, we're honored to have Aston on, on the show. Thank you, Tom. Thank you, HBO. I want to say thank you to Keith Beltre, the CEO of Roy Jones Junior Boxing. And I'm going to say thank you to Aston Felipe. We've uh, been with Aston for just over a year now. He made his debut in the States uh, December 2016 in Las Vegas when he faced at the time the WBC number five ranked contender Oscar Cantu with an Olympic alternate. And after that, uh, you no, know, just seemed just to fall into place for him. 115 of the rich division, as we all see. We know that Superfly brings out the very best to the division, as we saw with Chacolito, Cuadras, Estrada, etc. Uh, it's a big opportunity for us. We're aware of that, and actually looking forward to making the best of it. Thank you. Thank you, Guy. Uh, once again, uh, Guy is representing uh, Roy Jones uh, Junior Promotional Company. Um, now we'd like to uh, move to uh, Aston. If you want to say a few words. You know, these are the type of opportunities uh, to be on HBO, to fight for, you know, a, a vacant world title. It just, uh, this is what brings out the best in the fighters, and, and they know this is uh, a huge opportunity for them, and uh, we're honored to have Aston on the show. Aston, if you want to say a few words. Um, thank you so much, Sir Keith, Sir Guy, for this promotion. Uh, HBO, um, sa manager ko, Jason Zoom. Uh, ngayon, masaya po ako dahil sa laban na ito. Parawa, uh, pangarap ko rin po yung maging world champion at tumawag ko lang world championship. So, uh, ito na po yung time na uh, uh, mapakita ko kung anong meron ako, si Aston, at uh, sana po supportan niyo ako sa laban namin. I would like to thank uh, the promoters, 360 and particularly HBO, for giving me the opportunity to be part of this uh, fight. And um, I'm really happy that I'm um, being given this opportunity to fight and uh, I will do my very best to go ahead and get the win. Thank you, Aston. We're, we're looking forward to that. Um, what can I say? Donnie Nietzsche uh, has so many uh, championship defenses. Now he's moving up to, this is your fourth division, right, Donnie? Fourth division. Uh, both uh, Aston and Donnie will be training at a gym right down the street. There's another uh, great Filipino fighter who, who uh, has trained there before, Manny Pacquiao. So uh, everyone is familiar with the Wild Card Boxing Gym and, and Freddie Roach's gym. So uh, again, we're, we're happy uh, that they're both uh, will be training here in, in Los Angeles. With that, I want to pass the microphone to Donnie to say a few a few words. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Uh, Pasalamat po ako na binigyan kami ng opportunity ulit na makipaglaban dito sa US uh, sa Superfly Card. Uh, 
Nagpapasalamat po ako sa 360 Promotion, sa HBO po, and sa ABCBN, and sa ALA Promotion na makapaglaban ako ulit dito sa US. Uh, magandang laban ito. Uh, uh, pangapat ko na division, so pagkita ko talaga na magandang result na uh, laban namin. Thank you so much. I'm happy to be given this opportunity to fight. Uh, I'd like to thank the 360 Promotions and my promoter, Ana Promotions. And it's a big opportunity to be fighting in this event. And uh, we would like to thank you, thank everyone for the opportunity to be in this event. Thank you, Donnie. Um, that being the, uh, the co-feature, uh, it's going to be a Filipino rivalry uh, for the vacant title. Uh, the main event, we have a Mexican rivalry uh, between uh, Felipe uh, Orocuta. Uh, he's promoted by Promociones uh, del Pueblo, Osvaldo uh, Kikle, uh, and Juan Francisco Estrada, who had a tremendous performance against uh, uh, Sister Cat on Superfly 2. Um, you know, Juan wanted uh, the immediate rematch uh, for the WBC title. Sister Cat is, uh, he made, uh, he had a fight in Thailand, he wants to make a title defense in October, and so hopefully next year we can do the rematch. And right now, uh, Juan and uh, Felipe will be, it'll be a uh, official final el elimination. The winner will become the mandatory once again for, for Sister Cat, uh, sanctioned by the WBC. So with that, and I want to introduce uh, Juan Hernandez, who's, um, Start as manager. Juan, do you want to say a few words uh, first? And also, I need to point out that uh, I almost forgot that uh, Donnie is uh, promoted by Allah Promotions. We have a very good relationship with Allah Promotions in the Philippines. And naturally, uh, uh, Juan Francisco Estrada is uh, promoted by Xanthor Promotions, who's here represented by Juan Carlos Torres. So, uh, Juan, do you want to say a few words? Uh, on behalf of uh, yeah, thanks, Tom. Uh, thank you all for um, joining us here and supporting the Flyweight Series. We're very grateful to HBO for um, having Estrada be the headliner for this Superfly 3. He's actually the, the only fighter to be part of all the, the Superfly shows so far. Like Tom said, uh, Estrada actually wanted the rematch. He would rather have the rematch um, on Superfly 3. Unfortunately, we couldn't make it happen, but hopefully it'll uh, be part of Super, Superfly 4. Estrada had actually asked me if I could try to help him avenge his, uh, his two losses here in LA, one against uh, Sirsaket, which hopefully he can as part of uh, Superfly 4, and then he also asked me to try and help him avenge his loss against Chocolatito Gonzalez when they fought in 2012, which was another war. Um, I also want to say thanks to Roman Gonzalez for uh, opening the gates to uh, the, the smaller weight classes. It's because of him that uh, HBO took an interest in the smaller fighters and started the Super Fight Series. And uh, we thank him and his team for giving Estrada the opportunity to fight him back in 2012. Um, and uh, we're just excited to be here. Uh, Estrada is uh, very committed to this fight. He's actually training in, in altitude in Mexico City. He's here just for a day and a half and then goes back to training because he, he knows that this is a, a tremendous challenge there's no way he can lose this fight because then he would uh, pretty much lose the opportunity to fight uh, again again. So uh, he knows how serious this is. Uh, thank you all again for coming. Um, and I'll uh, hand over the microphone to the only fighter to be part of uh, the all three superflies as of now, Juan Francisco El Gallo Estrada. Buenas tardes. Pues estoy muy contento de estar aquí en Los Ángeles, eh, muy contento de formar esta, esta cartelera en Superfly 3. Eh, pues agradecer a mi empresa Latin Sport, a mi promotor Juan Hernández, eh, a la empresa eh, que, que está haciendo posible esta, esta función. Eh, 360 Promotion, gracias por la oportunidad. Eh, pues es una oportunidad más porque pues es una eliminatoria a hacia la revancha, ¿no? que, que pues mucha gente espera, que nosotros esperamos como, como peleadores y pues estamos echando las ganas para, pues, para ganar esta pelea y, y pues ir por la revancha contra Sir Saquetsu Rubisay. Uh, good afternoon everyone. 
thanks for, for coming to the press conference. I'm very excited to be here. I uh, want to thank my promoters. I want to thank 360 for giving me the opportunity of handling the show. I'm uh, training extremely hard for this, um, and I'm going to be ready for the fight. Pues ahorita estamos ya eh, pues a un mes de la pelea y estamos entrenando duro, estamos eh, en el Estado de México, en Toluca, en la altura, para, pues, para que no haya dudas, no haya eh, nada de, de, de pretextos, estamos entrenando duro para ganar contundentemente esta pelea, que vamos contra un mexicano que pues también quiere, quiere ganar y pues estamos entrenando duro para, para salir con la mano en alto. Muchas gracias. We're, uh, we're about a month away from the fight. Um, right after this press conference, I have to get ready to head back to my training camp in the, up in the mountains over by Toluca because I know how um, important this fight is and I know I need to have an impressive showing um, just to uh, continue being a part of the series. Thank you all. Thank you. Thank you, Juan Francisco. We're happy to have you back. And uh, Juan, it's good that you pointed that out. It's true. Uh, uh, El Gallo is the only uh, fighter to be on all Superfly series, so he's, he's always an exciting fight, and uh, we're excited to have him come back now. He's headlining the show. Uh, as I mentioned, it's a, it's a final eliminator for the WBC uh, World Championship, um, and uh, the winner will go on uh, to then get that opportunity again. We want to thank uh, Takate. We see the logo right here, but Takate will be the uh, title sponsor for Superfly 3, uh, and also on September 8th, uh, for HBO, it'll have uh, the installment of a uh, fight game special with uh, Jim Lampley. And uh, that's what uh, I think Tony Walker uh, was going to mention that uh, you know, one week before the, the big uh, Triple G and uh, Canelo fight, uh, Superfly 3 will be a, a great entree uh, and a great uh, lead in to that fight. And then afterwards, uh, after the show, uh, HBO is going to show the, uh, the fight fight game special. So with that, what I was alluding to with uh, September 15th, uh, uh, Chocotito Gonzalez, everyone is asking me, when is Chocotito going to fight again? He's such a fan favorite here. Fans uh, give him tremendous support. He sold out the Stuff Up Center when he had the fight there. Uh, he's been on so many great shows together with Triple G at Madison Square Garden, at the Forum. It's just uh, really tremendous performances. And so now we can officially announce that uh, Ramon Chopatito Gonzalez will be fighting September 15th in Las Vegas at the T-Mobile Arena, one of the greatest uh, venues uh, in the world, uh, has uh, so the biggest fights in the world. So with that, uh, again, we're honored to have him here at, at this media lunch. Um, I want to introduce uh, Carlos Landon, his manager uh, from Nicaragua, and uh, Chopatito is, uh, is promoted by Mr. Honda and Titan Promotions. And, uh, you know, with that, uh, Carlos, if you want to say a few words, and then we'll have uh, Juan uh, uh, speak as well. Thank you, Tom. Just want to say thank you to everyone. Uh, first and foremost, God. Thank you to Tom and 360 Promotions, our promoter in Japan, Mr. Honda from Taken Promotions, HBO, and just all the great fighters that we have here. We've known uh, for Juan El Gallo Estrada for a while now. We had an incredible match, like Juan's mentioned, it was definitely one of the best fights uh, in Roman's career. We are, we're definitely looking here some way in the future to uh, make that rematch happen. We know Tony Nietes from the minimum weights also, and also Katsuko Yoka, which is a great champion in Japan, which is our second home. And uh, we admire all of them and all the other great champions of Superfly. We really think that this is a great program and we just feel blessed to be part of it and uh, to have an opportunity to be back here in the States fighting again and finishing camp. And I uh, just want to thank everyone for, for supporting us and for making uh, the comeback for Amon a great one. Hola, muy buenas a todos. Eh, Dios me lo bendiga. Eh, Agradecerle una vez más a HBO por darme la oportunidad nuevamente de pelear eh, una pelea llena de bloqueo con Canelo me siento motivado de pelear en esa misma velada estoy con ansia nuevamente de volver nuevamente y ser campeón y estoy feliz pues entrenando un fuertísimo para ganar pues 
el 15 de septiembre vamos con un mexicano y primeramente yo vamos a salir con la mano en alto con, con ese entrenamiento que tengo con mi equipo de trabajo pues ha sido excelente y pues esperando en Dios que todo salga bien. Thank you very much. I want to thank God. I want to thank HBO, 360 Promotions, Taker Promotions. It's uh, great to be back here. It's a great opportunity to be able to fight again and to be received by so many people. We feel happy with the fight and um, we're looking forward to train very hard and to get a W on September 15th. And we're just happy to be back once again. Thank you to all. <coughs> Pues, igualmente invitando a la gente, al fanático del boxeo que, que no se pierdan esa, esa pelea y pues, y pues bendiciones para los campeones que tengo aquí sentado en, en esta humildemente en este asiento para mí es una bendición y que les deseo suerte y, y que Dios los bendiga wishes everyone the best and may God bless you all and see you soon on September 15th. Thank you Chuck Tito. definitely a uh, legend uh, in the sport of boxing, one of the greatest champions I've had the honor to work with and uh, as I mentioned everyone's excited to see him again September 15th. You know it's a tremendous uh, tremendous day today we have Hollywood fight nights tonight here from the Avalon the disco ball is still spinning up there from I think it's still hanging from the 70s up there but it's a historic building and uh, you know, then the Superfly 3 at the Forum, and then naturally uh, Triple G and, uh, and Canelo fighting uh, September 15th in, in Las Vegas. So we appreciate everyone coming out. We appreciate all the champions being here. We're going to, uh, Bernie can uh, pose uh, the fighters. Uh, we'll, we'll take a group photo uh, together, um, you know, with, with all these uh, tremendous uh, fighters up here in the ring. Thank you. Thank you. 